Greetings traders out there in trader land. D7 here with freetradingvideos.com. Do you know I was just talking to some people and they said that um, when they play our videos, the bumper music that we have, that their kids play air guitar when they hear it. I was out at dinner, oh, I don't know, a couple months ago now with some of the moderators for free trading videos and their wives who joined them um, <laughs> said that when they get up in the mornings um, that they hear my voice in the background being listened to by their husband. Anyway, if you would, I would be interested if there's any stories behind the scenes that Matador and myself just aren't privy to that you think that we'd find interesting, uh, please put them down in the comments. If you have your wife that just hates our voice at nights or in the mornings when they listen to our videos or the music that somebody likes, you know, we want to hear about that. And give us a taste of your world. Anyway, here we are in the markets, the Dow up a little bit and so is the NASDAQ. What's interesting, usually when the Dow is up, so is the S&P. And if there's any divergence, it's usually the NASDAQ and the Russell that's diverging. But in this case, we have the S&P and Russell's agreeing with each other and the NASDAQ and Dow agreeing with each other. It just shows you how messed up things are here. The VIX did drop 4%. Very nice. Check this out. The VIX under 25. Isn't that interesting? The question is, will it remain there? I'm not too sure, and let's talk about this. If we go back, um, we have a nice run. Gang, this is a very nice run that we had. Uh, we had this little downtrend, lower swing highs, lower swing lows, and, a, and it acted as a bull flag, and we had a nice breakout. Bam! And here at this very moment, we have a doji. This is a doji next to this candlestick. A doji just means that we do not have a big real body. It's a it's very small uh, body, and the open and close was very similar. So if I break this up just a little more, the S&P, that means the bears brought it down, but they couldn't hold it down, and we come rallying right back up. The bulls brought it up, couldn't hold it up, came right back down. So this is um, a... It could be a shifting of momentum. Usually a doji after an up leg or a down leg shows a, a indecision. An indecision could uh, be foreshadowing of a, of a reversal taking place. So we could get ourselves a correction. Now, isn't it interesting that this lower shadow came down and just touched our line right here, which gave us a low of about 9.35, um, if you rounded it, just a little lower than that, and which we were saying would should be a support area. We were just saying that, I think, this morning in this morning's video that I did. So anyway, what I am looking for on Monday is do we cross or do we not only do we go lower than um, today's low, which was 934.65 or 935, but will we close lower than that? If so, that could um, bring a nice little correction, a down leg. And if I were to draw a fib from this low to this high right there, uh, where might we get some support? See this 38.2 puts us at 915, um, which would put us right here where this 50-day moving average is. Then the next area is 906 area, which would be around the 20-day moving average area. And 61.8, which would put us right here around these major trend lines, which would that would have to it would have to stop there if it was going to continue to be bullish so we could drop and then bounce that would give us a higher swing low at that point i'd be looking to go long this market so there you have it now listen um there's been a number of people wondering if they're going to get an email. Let me say it again. No. Um, for you subscribers that have subscribed to the V newsletter, there's no email. What you And you don't need a new username and password. All you need to do is log in and click the link on the home page up in the top right corner. It says free training videos, V newsletter. You click on that link and you will have direct access. 
And in that video, you will get a password. That password um, will get you access to the private forum, V Newsletter forum, um, inside the forums. So you can go in there and chat with other V Newsletter subscribers about different plays that are setting up. So anyway, there you are. Looking forward um, to also delivering to you a weekend edition, and that weekend edition will be coming out on Saturday. Matador and myself will be doing the V Newsletter actually very late tonight, Friday night. We're, this is a you. Um, I have a big trading club that I run here, and that's tomorrow, so I can't do the V Newsletter tomorrow, so we're going to be doing it at midnight tonight, Eastern Standard Time. So if you're around, we might be in the chat rooms. Come by and say hi.